Welcome everyone, brace yourselves for an exciting journey through the beating heart of the South, the vibrant city of New Orleans, Louisiana. In the next few minutes, we'll unveil the city's hidden gems, delve into its rich history, and immerse ourselves in the intoxicating culture that makes this city truly unique. From mouth-watering cuisine to soul-stirring music, and from historic landmarks to thrilling adventures, we've got it all covered. So buckle up, because we're about to dive into the top 10 things to do in New Orleans. Kicking off our countdown at number 10, we have exploring the historic French Quarter. This vibrant neighborhood is the heart and soul of New Orleans, steeped in centuries-old traditions and rich cultural heritage. It's a delightful blend of old and new, where French and Spanish architecture rub shoulders with jazzy music and lively street performances. One could spend an entire day simply walking through the narrow cobblestone streets, admiring the well-preserved Creole townhouses with their iconic ironwork balconies. The French Quarter is also home to the famous Bourbon Street, known for its energetic nightlife, vibrant bars and street parties. But the French Quarter isn't just about the party scene, it's also a treasure trove of history, art and culture. The historic St. Louis Cathedral, the Cabildo and the Presbytery are all must-see landmarks. A trip to New Orleans is incomplete without experiencing the lively spirit of the French Quarter. At number 9, step back in time with a cruise on the iconic steamboat Natchez. This isn't your average boat ride, folks. The steamboat Natchez offers a unique journey along the Mississippi River, combining history, entertainment, and breathtaking views. Imagine the sun setting over the Crescent City as you glide along the water, the city skyline shrinking in the background. You'll be serenaded by the tunes of a live jazz band, their melodies intertwining with the rhythmic churning of the steamboat's paddle wheel. But there's more to this cruise than just pleasing the senses. As you relax on the deck, you'll hear tales of the river and its historic significance. Learn about the steamboats that once dominated these waters and the role they played in shaping New Orleans. Indulge in some southern hospitality with a delicious meal on board and let the rhythm of the river carry you away. For a truly unique New Orleans experience, you can't beat a ride on the steamboat Natchez. Art enthusiasts, get ready. At number eight, we suggest visiting the New Orleans Museum of Art. Known locally as NOMA, this museum is a treasure trove of over 40,000 works, spanning 5,000 years of history. From European masterpieces to American art, from contemporary exhibits to an extensive photography section, this museum has something for every art aficionado. NOMA was established in 1916, making it a centenarian institution steeped in rich history. Within its walls, you can witness some of the world's most significant pieces. It's not just about the art on the walls, but also the stories they tell, the cultures they represent, and the eras they embody. And let's not forget about the Sydney and Walda Besthoff Sculpture Garden. With over 60 sculptures scattered across five acres, it's the perfect blend of art and nature, a true oasis in the city. So, if you're an art lover, make sure the New Orleans Museum of Art is on your list. Coming in at number 7, indulge your sweet tooth with beignets at Café du Monde. This iconic café, nestled in the heart of the French market, has been serving up these delightful, fluffy, sugar-dusted pastries since 1862. Yes, you heard that right, over a century and a half of beignet brilliance. The beignets at Café du Monde are a tradition, a cultural staple that has woven itself into the very fabric of New Orleans. Made from deep-fried shoe pastry and generously dusted with powdered sugar, these square-shaped treats are more than just a dessert. They are an experience, a sensory delight that marries the crisp exterior with the soft, warm interior, creating an explosion of flavors in your mouth. Paired with a steaming cup of their chicory coffee, it's an unbeatable combination that has locals and tourists alike coming back for more. So, when in New Orleans, make sure you stop by Café du Monde for a beignet or three. Trust us, your taste buds will thank you for this one. Halfway through our list at number six, we recommend a visit to the picturesque Garden District. This charming neighborhood is known for its historic mansions and lush greenery. A walk through its streets is like stepping into a time capsule, where the 19th century Southern charm meets the vibrant culture of today. The Garden District was established in the early 1800s during the city's Golden Age. It was here that the cotton and sugar barons built their grand mansions surrounded by beautiful gardens. Today, these homes stand as a testament to New Orleans' rich history, with their well-preserved architecture and ornate details. But it's not just about the houses. The district's overall ambiance is something to experience. 
The towering oak trees, the blooming magnolias, the ivy-covered walls, and the iron-laced balconies all contribute to the district's enchanting atmosphere. You might even spot a celebrity or two, as many famous personalities have homes here. A stroll through the Garden District is like stepping into a southern fairy tale. At number 5, immerse yourself in the city's soulful music scene with a jazz show. Now we're stepping into the heartbeat of New Orleans, jazz. The city is known as the birthplace of this genre, its rhythms flowing as freely as the Mississippi River. Walk down Frenchman Street, and you'll be greeted by the captivating sound of trumpets, saxophones, and pianos wafting from popular venues like the Spotted Cat or Snug Harbor. Each place has its own unique vibe, but they all share one thing in common, a profound love for jazz. Expect an intimate setting where the line between performers and audience members blurs. You'll feel every beat, every note, and every emotion as if the music is a part of you. And the best part? You'll be sharing this experience with locals and travelers alike, all swaying to the same rhythm, all touched by the spirit of jazz. A jazz show in New Orleans is an absolute must for music lovers. At number four, take a historical journey through the National One Two Museum. This isn't just a museum, folks, it's a time capsule, a teleportation device that whisks you back to the 1940s when the world was at war. Here, you'll find an impressive collection of artifacts, personal accounts, and photographs that bring to life the stories of those who lived, fought, and died during this monumental period. From the iconic aircraft and tanks to the deeply moving exhibit on the D-Day invasion, every corner of this museum is steeped in history. The National Wood Museum is more than just a collection of dusty old relics. It's a testament to the resilience of the human spirit, a tribute to the bravery of the men and women who defended freedom. It's a place where you can walk in the footsteps of heroes and bear witness to the sacrifices made for our tomorrow. This museum offers a poignant and fascinating look into a pivotal time in world history. Getting close to the top now, at number three, explore the mysterious and beautiful swamps of Louisiana. Not your typical tourist attraction, the swamps of Louisiana are a world of their own. A stunning blend of water and land, these sprawling wetlands harbor a unique ecosystem teeming with life. From the lurking alligators to the chirping birds, from the moss-draped cypress trees to the blooming water lilies, the swamps are a testament to nature's resilience and adaptability. And the best part? You can dive right into this wilderness. Numerous operators offer swamp tours, each one more thrilling than the last. Glide through the murky waters in an airboat or paddle your way in a canoe for a more intimate encounter. Take a detour from the bustling city life and let the serene, untamed beauty of the swamps enchant you. This is not just sightseeing, it's an experience, an adventure that'll leave an indelible mark on your memory. This is a unique adventure that you won't want to miss. At number two, visit the historic and eerie St. Louis Cemetery. Now this isn't your everyday graveyard. This aged, hauntingly beautiful site is the oldest cemetery in New Orleans, dating back to the late 18th century. You see, the Big Easy has a unique way of honoring their dead. Instead of traditional below-ground burials, the city's high water table necessitated the use of above-ground tombs, turning these resting places into miniature architectural marvels. Among the labyrinth of tombs, you'll find some famous, or should we say infamous, residents. The voodoo queen of New Orleans, Marie Laveau, is said to rest here, attracting curious visitors from around the world. And let's not forget the ornate Italian marble tomb of the Mousson family, relatives of the renowned French artist Edgar Degas. Visiting the St. Louis Cemetery isn't just a stroll among the tombs, it's a walk through centuries of history, culture, and legends. This is an unforgettable and slightly spooky experience that's quintessentially New Orleans. And finally at number one, the ultimate New Orleans experience, celebrating Mardi Gras. Originating in France, Mardi Gras, or Fat Tuesday, made its American debut in the city of New Orleans in the 18th century. This extravagant festival, brimming with vibrant parades, colorful costumes, and energizing music, is a feast for the senses. Why does Mardi Gras top our list, you ask? Well, it embodies the spirit of New Orleans, a city that knows how to throw a party. It's not just about the spectacle, it's about community, tradition, and a celebration of life that lights up the city streets. From catching beads thrown from the parade floats to indulging in the traditional king cake, Mardi Gras is a carnival that immerses you in the unique culture of New Orleans. You are not just witnessing an event, you are participating in a centuries-old tradition, 
Experiencing Mardi Gras in New Orleans is a lifetime experience that tops our list. And there you have it, folks. The top 10 things to do in New Orleans, Louisiana. From exploring the historic French Quarter, cruising on the steamboat Natchez, to experiencing the vibrant Mardi Gras. What a ride it's been. We've tasted beignets, got lost in art, and even danced to the rhythm of jazz. Thanks for joining us on this journey. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and share it with your friends. Until next time, happy travels.